Well, this is a gorgeous way to start a video. Michael, B. Jordan. Hey, what's up, man? Popping into your workout for a 73-question uh, interview. Let's do this. Let's do this. OK, so what are you up to these days? I'm working, working out. Right, what's a daily workout regimen? Cardio, uh, do some chest, back, tries, the whole body. <laughs> All right, can you show me the perfect punch? All right, let's do this. Right here, turn it over. Bring okay. back guard to face. All right, can you show me the perfect sit-up? Trying to make me work? Making you work. Eesh. There we go. Ugh. Including this one right here, approximately how many times has someone made a reference to the basketball player, Michael Jordan? Is that what you're doing right now? I'm doing that right now. Too many to count. So just to clarify, you're not related to Michael Jordan? No, I mean that to my dad. Uh, Michael A. Jordan. Oh, so what does the B stand for? Bakari Swahili, it means of noble promise. Is there a Michael C. Jordan in the future? Nah, that's not happening. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what do you have planned for today? Going downtown, check out some friends of mine. Okay, who's your best friend? Oh, Sterling Brim, Chad Easterling, Vince, Bryce, there's so many to name, it's a lot of them. Who's your celebrity crush? Don't have one. Who's your hero? My dad. Who's your all-time favorite comic book character? Uh, Black Vault in Humans. How would you describe yourself? I think I'm pretty passionate. What's the one thing you really want to achieve? World domination. I really want to leave my mark on this world. It's Mrs. Jordan. Hey, what's up? Hey, how are you? Doing good. Good, good, good. Good yeah. to see you. So what do we have over here? Oh, it's my grandmother's uh, famous rum kicks. They're amazing. You take one home, too. OK, what's the most outrageous thing you've ever worn, Michael? Um, what are you in? What's the most outrageous thing I've ever worn? Oh, I know right away. It's that orange plaid suit that you wore. Yeah, listen, well, I was trying to take a fashion <laughs> risk. Can you describe your mother in three words? Uh, mom, loving. Embarrassing. Sometimes. And uh, nurturing, very nurturing. You said that? Please, take that to me. All right. all right, what's your favorite TV show of all time? Ooh, Martin, can't stop watching. What you do, nudity in a scene or use a body double? <laughs> nudity, of course, all nudity. No body double. Okay, can you uh, tell me something about your father before uh, we meet him? Don't look him right in the eyes. Yeah. Noted. What's up, Pop? Hey, what's up, son? Good, good. How you doing? Yes, sir. Good, good, Mr. Sir. Jordan, if you can ask your son a question, what would you ask? Describing me in three words, what would they be? Three words, what would it be? Strong, quiet, thinker. And Michael, I heard you have a secret handshake? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's universal, it's not so secret. <laughs> All right, what's the best trait you got from your parents? Oh man, uh, I think compassion. Compassion. All right, what's your favorite film? Rounders. What's your favorite film when you were growing up? Goonies, uh, Trading Places, Coming to America, Friday. How old were you when you first started acting? About 12. If not acting, what would you be doing with your life? I think cooking, I love food. All right, do you have a hidden talent? Ironing, I like the iron, I think that counts. Hmm. Okay, so on this uh, giant map over here, yeah. can you show for me the coolest place you've ever been? Coolest place? Cape Town, South Africa. Okay, and what's the location that you love to go to? Oh man, I'm obsessed. Tokyo, Japan. Nice. Anime, it's the best. So when looking back at your life, when was the most nervous you've ever been? Presenting, I think presenting uh, awards sometimes, teleprompters, it gets, it gets weird. Who's your dream co-star? Oh man, Leonardo DiCaprio. Who's easier to impersonate, Sly Stallone as Rocky or Kyle Chandler as Coach Taylor? Sly, Rocky. How many punches did you take while filming Creed? <laughs> Probably more than I should, but uh, a lot, a lot. What was it like training for Creed? Intense, hardest thing I ever had to do, physically anyway. And what was your first impression of Mr. Stallone anyway? The guy knows a little bit about everything. I mean, he could tell you like who made the camera, the where is this wood imported from, the desk. He, he just the things that you don't think he knows, he knows. Like mm. he's just a little savant like that. All right. So what do we uh, have in this room over here? Oh, this is where all the creativity happens. A lot of work, a lot of writing, a lot of thinking. Okay. Yeah. Favorite video game of all time? Call of Duty, hands down. How does it feel playing yourself in NBA 2K17? Surreal, I love that game. I played it so much <laughs> growing good. up as a kid. Now I'm in it, it's insane. Who's MVP this year? Oh, the controversy, mm. that's a loaded question. Mm -hmm. Kyrie Irving, the situation is just set up for him in Boston that way, I think. But he's a killer, you already know. Okay, so who's your favorite actress? Meryl Streep. And what's your favorite performance of hers ever? Uh, Death Becomes Her, it's a classic. Mm. What's your number one dating rule? 
always pick up the tab, at first anyway, and then uh, she never touches the doorknob. What gets you really pumped? Music. What takes you off? Being hung up on. What are you most nostalgic for from the 90s? 90s, 90s, 90s. Homemade mixtapes. Favorite line from anything you've worked on? Favorite line. Where's Wallace? Mm -hmm. If you could hire anyone to make a doc about your life, who would it be? Ryan Coogler. Uh, what would the title be? The gift that keeps on giving. Favorite beverage? Uh, apple juice, you want one? Yeah. It's favorite food? Oh man, that's tough. Um, here you go. Thanks. Mexican, Italian? Okay. Who's someone you really want to meet but haven't had the chance? Malcolm Gladwell. Who's the most stylish person, living or not living? Mm. Prince. For real. What's the song guaranteed to uh, get you dancing? Alicia Myers, I want to thank you. Can you show me that dance move? There it is. Hey. There it is. It's a two step. All right, who's your favorite singer? Marvin Gaye. Favorite novelist? James Baldwin. Favorite artist? Hebrew Brantley Basquiat. What's the craziest rumor you've ever heard about yourself? That I don't date black women. If you could have a superpower, what would it be? Control time, because then technically you could teleport. Who do you want to play in a movie? Action hero slash quantum physicist? Who would you want to play you in a movie? Me? Okay, and let's say a book was written about you. Who would you want to write your biography? Me. I know you gotta get out of here, but what can fans expect from Black Panther? Oh man, I think it's, uh, I think it's gonna be incredibly original, exciting, action-packed. I really think it's a, a movie you haven't seen from Marvel just yet. Can you give a reaction to the following? Shoot. Okay, The Wire. Baltimore, crab cakes. Philadelphia. Cheesesteaks. Fidget spinners. Video games. Your sister. Mom number two. Your brother. Extremely loyal. New Jersey. Newark. Your fellow 73 Question alum, Zach Efron. The <laughs> heartthrob? <Yes. laughs> you flattered to hear that. What's the most important thing that's missing in the world right now? I think the world is missing a carbon tax. Michael, dear our parents. Michael. Look who's back. You're leaving. Hi. Here. Hey. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. All right, man. See you later, yeah. All right, thank All right. you. <laughs> the perks of parents. <laughs> What's the cause or topic that you want to share right now? Police brutality in America. What charitable organizations are close to your heart? Lupus LA. What's something you learned recently that blew your mind? You can't lick your elbow. It's impossible. That's not true. That's not true. Just go ahead and try it. No, man. I'm not going to yeah, try right now. Because the last question is right here. Can I have the honor of saying that I have a secret handshake with you? Yeah. All right, cool. You coming? Yep, yep, sure. Cool. Right, just Thanks. Work on that. All right, well, that concludes our interview. Cool. All right, man. Really appreciate your time, Michael. Thanks for coming through. All right, take care. All right. Thanks.